video made at Roladeo.com. Creating a video is now extremely easy with Roladeo. Qatar Airways tells plus size model to upgrade to first class because she didn't fit an economy. Juliana Nema claimed that the airline had told her to shell out about $3,000 to upgrade to first class, and would not refund her the $947 she had spent on the flight from Beirut, Lebanon, to Doha, Qatar. She shared her experience in Instagram videos that each have more than 60,000 likes, with commenters calling out Qatar Airways and asking them to take action. I bought a return ticket to Brazil through Qatar and arriving at the time to check in, a Qatar flight attendant called my mother while another staffer was finishing our check-in, and told her I wasn't welcome to board because I'm fat, she said. She told her followers that she had missed her connecting flight to Sao Paulo due to the incident, claiming that she had had no issues boarding an Air France flight previously and that she had been threatened when attempting to take a video. Qatar Airways told Fox Business that Neymar had been extremely aggressive with staff members, and that security had to be called over twice to calm her down. They said she had been scaring both workers and passengers who had been checking in. The passenger in question at Beirut Airport was initially extremely rude and aggressive to check-in staff when one of her traveling party did not produce required PCR documentation for entry to Brazil. As a result, airport security was requested to intervene as staff and passengers were extremely concerned with her behavior, it concluded. Qatar Airways said Neyma was rebooked on a flight from Lebanon. It was not clear whether she had to pay for an upgrade to be allowed to fly. Let's see some comments on Reddit. I mean, if you don't physically fit in a seat, you don't have many options. Pay the upcharge, or find an alternative. Pretty straightforward. That, or focus on losing some weight, but we know that isn't an acceptable option. I once had a fight where I had to sit next to a very, very obese man, it was a two-hour flight where I had no choice but to literally be pushed up against his fat folds for the whole flight as his body spilled over into my seat, it was absolutely disgusting and no one should be forced to fly in those conditions. It's about safety, they're not shaming her. I'm sure airline employees see enough in a workday that they don't care if you're 800 pounds. They're just tasked with the safety of all passengers. Why can't people realize that while overweight people shouldn't be harassed, their weight shouldn't also be encouraged or supported? I don't understand why we need to pretend that being obese is healthy, I struggled with my weight in my younger years and now that I'm finally in shape I have no desire to return to where I was. She needs two seats for sure. I've sat to fat people before in economy, it's hell. Plus sized, the hoops we jump through to avoid stating the obvious these days. When I read plus size model I had a certain expectation in mind, and it was way worse. Fat? No. This woman is morbidly obese. She actually owes the airline an apology for putting them in the awkward position to explain an obvious situation. That woman has never fit in a single airline seat before and she knew she couldn't then. Thank goodness someone is finally leading the way on this issue. I for one am very tired of getting squished, sweat on, and asked if someone can raise the armrest so that they may encroach even farther into my personal space. I only said okay to that once. Never again. I've had to forcibly hold down the armrest in one case when they tried not to take no for an answer. Qatar Airways policy is any passenger who impedes upon the space of a fellow traveler and cannot secure their seat belt or lower their armrests may be required to purchase an additional seat both as a safety precaution and for the comfort and safety of all passengers. Pretty cut and dry here. If they were sold out of economy seats this is the next option to buy a biz class ticket or take another flight where you can buy two economy seats together. What's the alternative? Qatar Airlines was looking out for the other passengers. That's a body that takes half of your seat if she's sitting next to you. Only half? On both sides. The worst is when fat women call themselves curvy. No. Kim Kardashian is curvy. You are fat. Put down the cheeseburger. Video made at Roladeo.com. Roladeo is a super easy tool to automatically create videos with auto-generated voiceovers and the exact subtitles. Thanks for watching.